Good evening, everyone, and welcome to this uh, Saturday night edition of the Balmoral Beat. My name is Tom Kelly. I'm joined by our track announcer, handicapper extraordinaire, Dominic Polito. And we decided to uh, spruce up the show, give it a little <laughs> class, a little toughness tonight. A little we, beauty. Yep. We've got 14-year-old uh, Jordan Pickering from Tinley Park here with us tonight as uh, part of the uh, St. Baldrick's event going on here at Balmoral Park. Uh, you can check out your programs, all kind of things going on around Balmoral Park to uh, benefit the St. Baldrick's Foundation. And uh, Jordan, thank you for taking the time uh, to come up here and uh, join Dominic and I and maybe give the fans a couple of winners and tell us a little bit about yourself. Okay. Well, we you know you're a seventh grader. You live in Tinley Park. Go to Summit Hill Junior High School. Uh, you love softball, ballet, and dancing, but uh, you've overcome uh, quite a bit uh, throughout your life already. And uh, how just how tough has it been? It's been, like, really tough because it's been, like, we have my younger sister, and then, like, we have to deal with what she had to do with, like, getting her to school and stuff. Like, like going to school with her, or then, like, we would have to find someone to watch her, and then it's, like, tough to find someone to stay with me if, with her. and yeah. Plenty of support <laughs> from the family, from the school, from the community. Yeah. Everybody worked together. And then as of last year, you were officially diagnosed cancer-free. Mm-hmm. That's wonderful. What did it feel like when you when you got that diagnosis and, and heard those words, cancer-free? Because then, like, I felt, like, kind of happy because then I didn't need to get, po like, pointed with needles anymore or, like, any more shots. It's a wonderful thing. Well, it's, it's yep, really and I'm sure uh, the support group and mom and dad and everybody's been great and helped you along. And any other friends or anybody else you'd like to mention out there that, uh, that's gone out of their way to help you? Um... Well, like, just like my friend Brooke, and then like my friend Sammy I've met over the years, and then my friend Ashley who is re recently just got a diagnosed with, uh, uh, with the same exact ca cancer that I just got over with, and then like other people from Camp Quality and stuff. All right, now uh, as part of the uh, St. Baldrick's uh, night here, uh, there's going to be some head shaving uh, going on in the winner's circle, and uh, I think you've got uh, somebody a little special you're going to shave the head of tonight, huh? Yeah. Who's that? Um, like my dad and then like one of the drivers. Okay. John Roberts, John Roberts. Has, uh, has volunteered to come down and this will all take place uh, in the winter circle after race three tonight. Uh, John, graciously enough, uh, will be coming down to uh, help benefit the St. Baldrick's Foundation. will be coming down. And uh, Jordan will show off her uh, barbering skills and hairstylist skills on uh, John and on Dad, huh? All right. Now, this is your first trip to the racetrack, I hear? Yeah. But you've already you've come up with three horses for us in the first three races, right? <laughs> Jordan's daily double tonight is going to be four Elijah's Jet in the first race with two Dallas Jones in the second race. And then that third race, which is the uh, St. Baldrick's Fight Against Childhood Cancer race, She's uh, given us number seven, Katie Ryan, is her selection. Uh, should be a nice price there, and hopefully uh, Jordan will be picking out some winners. But uh, no matter what happens with the horses, Jordan, you're a winner already. It certainly is, yes. Well, thank you for joining us tonight. Have fun, and uh, let us know how that goes. And uh, stop back, see us again, and uh, let us know if you decide to go into the hairstyling. Uh, <laughs> Dominic and I will have yeah. to come see you. Yes, we will. <laughs> Thank you, Jordan. All right, Thanks. Jordan Pickering uh, here as part of the uh, St. Baldrick's Foundation Night. Let's take a look now at the uh, conditions for uh, this evening's card here at Belmoral Park. We are currently under. We're going to send it down to Ken Chirilli in the winner's circle. We want to thank you guys for coming out tonight. Tonight's a special night here at Balmoral Park. Tonight is our annual St. Baldrick's event. And for those of you that don't know what that is, it's a national organization that helps raise funds to fight childhood cancer. And we have a very special guest with us here tonight. What you see here in this really, really subtle green jacket is Jordan Pickering. Jordan is a 14-year-old seventh grader at uh, Summit, Summit Junior High in Tinley. She's from Tinley Park. We have her sister Kaylee here and her dad David. And the really special thing about these guys here tonight is Jordan was diagnosed at 18 months old with, um, what was it called again? ALL leukemia. ALL leukemia. She battled back. She, was, she relapsed at some point, battled back again. And tonight is a really special night for her because in August of last year, 
she was able to put together two words that most people take for granted, and that's cancer-free. So how about a big round of applause for our cancer-free Jordan Pickering. So we wanted to thank her for coming out and let everybody know that there is hope with this kind of thing. You can fight back for it. For Jordan, who did an amazing job earlier on our pre-race show, we wanted to give her, she's a, she's a softball player, she's into soccer, and from what I understand, she's also a dancer. So Balmoral Park wanted to get you something. So we have, as soon as I can get out of my pocket here, a $100 gift certificate to Star Dance Square in Orland Park. So you can set yourself up with some hip hop shoes or ballet shoes or whatever it is that you need. And then in addition to this tonight, what Jordan's gonna do, actually what her dad David is gonna do, and Kaylee's gonna join in on, is uh, she's gonna shave her dad's head, which is the traditional thing for St. Baldrick's, is the head shaving to make everybody feel united in the fight against cancer. And John Roberts has, uh, has to come down as well. So John, a big hand of applause for, for John. He's going to let Jordan give a whack at his head as well. So we've got Kara Scott who's going to handle things from Kara Scott Hair Design. You guys want to have a seat? Jordan is going to be the newest barber in the history of America right now. There's a lot of trust put in by these two men right now. So Jordan, why don't you come in here behind? We can practice on John first, and then we'll get your dad second. And then Kara will help you out. And here we go, the first of what could be the newest stylist hair in America. And a very trusting John Roberts. Let's get something in the front for everybody to see. Leaf is here. <laughs> and the great thing about this is, again, all the money raised tonight and across the country this, uh, this month goes to St. Baldrick's to help fight childhood cancer. And you wouldn't imagine the, the people that don't know this resource that, uh, that really comes in handy when they don't feel like they've got anywhere to turn, um, helps uh, research, helps support, uh, helps in a lot of different ways, a lot of different families. And not just the kids that are affected, obviously the families, the, uh, the, fa the parents and the brothers and sisters and friends and relatives. So there we go. That's called the reverse mohawk. All right, I think that's good enough. He looks good. We can move on now. <laughs> we can move on to your dad. And I think Kaylee came in here to get in part of the fun. <laughs> yeah. If we can get 50 bucks, the mustache goes too. There we go. The hunt, here, go, here, go, there we go. There we go. Here goes the. That was expect, a turn he did not expect coming. And there we go. It's off. And then we'll do, uh, can we do the mustache with these clippers? We'll just do half a mustache. Okay. I think we're going to let Kara handle the mustache. And that's a favor to you. <laughs> now he's giving instructions. <laughs> I think we're good. I think that's the picture we want right there. That is St. Baldrick's. Ladies and gentlemen, Jordan Pickering, a, a cancer survivor from Tinley Park. Thanks for coming out. We've got a lot of things going on in the north end of the grandstand. Uh, drawings for prizes. Uh, there's head shaving going on until 930. All the money goes to St. Baldrick's for this absolutely wonderful cause. And families as wonderful as this.